All right, guys, let me show you how to make buñuelos the easy way. Growing up every Christmas, my grandmother would make buñuelos de viento. It was only until I got much older that I realized that there was different ways to enjoy buñuelos and this here is one of the most popular ways. Let me show you a quick and easy way using only four ingredients that you most likely already have at home. Start off by grabbing store-bought flour tortillas. Next you are going to heat up some vegetable oil in a pan at enough to make sure that you can coat the whole tortilla when it goes in there. While you are waiting for the oil to heat up, you are going to get a bowl and add cinnamon and sugar. I simply measured with my senses here. Mix it all up with a spoon and make sure that it has the consistency that you see here. After mixing it in a bowl, transfer it to a plate and then even it out. Next, you are going to get your tortilla and you're going to test out the oil just like you saw me doing. And once you see the oil bubbling, you are going to put in your tortilla for about two minutes on each side until it gives you a golden brown or a dark golden brown color. Once done, very carefully get some tongs and add the hot tortilla onto the plate with the cinnamon and sugar and very carefully drizzle the cinnamon and sugar on top of the hot tortilla with a spoon. Make sure that you're doing this while the tortilla is still hot because you are going to be using the oil as a type of glue to help the cinnamon and sugar stick. Once you've done that, get very clean hands or your tongs and you're going to lift up the tortilla and remove any excess cinnamon and sugar and then transfer to another plate. And you are done. Either serve immediately while hot, it can also be enjoyed cold. Some people like to enjoy it just like this or like to add like a thick piloncillo type of syrup right on top before consuming. That's how it was first introduced to me, but either way, you're in for a delicious treat. I presented this with some cafe de la olla and it was a hit. Follow for more.